And so, on something very interesting, Touchline and AKA have informed their fans on Twitter that they will not be part of this year's Colin First. Starting with AKA, who said he couldn't come to an agreement with them, but he wishes them nothing but the best. Touchline said, Good day. My team wasn't contacted regarding my availability for Colin First JSB, and my inclusion on the lineup was not confirmed by me or my team. Unfortunately, this does not align with my schedule. Sorry to my fans and fans of the event, but I won't be able to make it. Regards. And he came back to say, it is important to note that miscommunications do happen, especially in such a big event. And it is one of those cases. I hope you guys can still go out in numbers because this is an important event for the culture. I just needed to be transparent with you guys. Thank you, Bafet. With some fans asking what other commitments could be bigger than Cotton First and some saying that Touchline might regret that decision. Some rumors suggested that most of the people that perform there do not get paid. But Zanzi A-listers has not been able to confirm that. And this was intensified by the inclusion of Touchline on the lineup without him or his management knowing because with most performance contracts, a small deposit is usually paid before an artist or an artist's name slash pictures are placed on any promotional material. However, they have added black coffee, which excited a lot of fans to see an international artist that big on the lineup. By the way, you guys let us know what you think. Comment down below. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up.